I think I became excited by this movie for the same reasons that he was excited by it. And I was specifically excited that, you know, it was John Stefan making this movie. Uh, I knew how immersive it would be uh, having seen his films. I knew that it was going to be such an intense movie and that it would give me an opportunity one as an actor, you know, to, to really dive into a world in, in such an authentic and, and real uh, intense way. But then also, yeah, to do it through the eyes of, 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 of these medics, I think, uh, I, I didn't know much about the the community before we started doing research for for the film, but I absolutely fell in love with the EMS community and all the medics that we started speaking to, and they they embraced us. And so, I think the preparation and and the opportunity um, was really special because essentially the the community was meeting us with arms wide open and show just basically asking, hey, what do you want to see? We'll take you on ride alongs. We'll take you know, put you in the classroom environment, teach you how to do CPR, teach you how to give IVs, teach you how to intubate. So, and based on the way Jean Stefan makes his films, you know, we knew that that was going to be super crucial, right? That we looked like we really knew what we were doing and that we looked like real medics. And so that was a, a very important part of, of the process. And then, you know, just the chaos of, of, of New York and, and, you know, the reality that Jean speaks of that, that, that kind of bled, into the movie and you know i think it, it was a fascinating uh kind of you know dynamic between you know something that is uh you know scripted quote unquote right and then and then coupling that with something that's that's real that's completely um unbridled and how, how what that dynamic becomes it becomes a, a something on its own and i think that was really interesting to me in terms of how to explore the the character you know, I do think I do think he's uh, a hero. I think anybody who who does this this job is a hero. You know, it, it takes a, it takes a, a hero's mentality to yeah. to do this and to carry the weight and to carry every day the responsibility of being the angels of society and trying to save people from death. I think that's a very very uh, heavy weight to carry, and uh, so. I would say he's a hero just purely because he's he's a, he's a paramedic and they're all heroes. So Ty, I thought that the back and forth, the relationship between you and and uh, Sean Penn was very very unique because in a way you represent light and he represents uh, the the opposites of optimism. So mm. how did you start the relationship? I know you're a better actor too, but he's uh, kind of older than you and he has more experience. But how was that? Yeah, I'm not not nearly as veteran as Sean is. Um, no, no. So yeah, no, it's it's always a pleasure to to work with someone uh, like Sean, and I think that he brings a certain intensity to the set and to the role, which is which is great. You know, he really values uh, and respects these these people, the first responder community, and uh, so I think we had that in common. You know, we both really cared about this community and cared about conveying the reality of 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 their lives and as you say you know maybe he represents some of the more um i think you use the term uh you know optimism for me and maybe pessimism for for sean i actually think that the characters are almost a mirror of each other you know and that sean's character could really be my own character if i were to continue down the path for 25 years so in a way it's like you know for my character it's like he's looking into the future at his future self and I think um, Jean Stefan so brilliantly kind of uh, created parallels in their in the characters' lives uh, in a really interesting way in terms of their personal relationships um, with their with their wife or their girlfriend or ex wife and and the child. Um, so yeah, it was it was a kind of fascinating experience, you know, to lean to have Sean working with him so collaboratively, and also to lean on him. Uh, as well through this process. Uh, it was very, uh, it was a great partnership.